Good morning, I am Ricky and today is Friday, February 14, 2020, and this is your Riverhawk Morning News. Monday is President's Day. No school on Monday. Today's spirit theme is Comfy Cozy Day. Are you wearing comfy sweats or joggers? Today is Valentine's Day. Art students are making puffy origami hearts with kind messages. Mrs. Lance is placing them all over campus for other students to find. Have fun looking for them and thanks for sharing the love. Bring your change and dollars on Tuesday for pennies for patients. The money donated goes to people who are fighting blood diseases. You will be competing with other fourth period classes. You can donate all next week. Seventh grade students. Today is Friendship Day. After school, it is put on by web. Come enjoy fun and games. Today is Parents Lunch Day. Both lunches. Let's be good hosts and be polite and picking up our trash. Let's make our parents proud. We are learning that teens spend a lot of time on their phone, computers, or tablets. Too much screen time can lead to problems. Let's take a look. Oh wait, sorry, my hair is sticking out. I don't know. I don't know what else to say. So. Oh, no D&D club today because of Friendship Day. The Pride Club will meet on Tuesday, 2-18th after school in room F2 since there is no school on Monday. The Yearbook Club is meeting, in, is meeting on Tuesday, 2-18th after school in room B3. Basketball game, b games on Tuesday, the 18th at Pinkerton Middle School. One last serious thing from Jonathan and Joshua. Three months into the last day of school. Our time on this mortal plane is the shortest and the longest thing you'll ever experience. Before we talk, let's talk about something we can agree on. Life is too short. Because of this, you should live life to the best you can, because you don't know when it's going to end. Appreciate what you have now, because most people don't have what you have. While you're walking around, people are bedridden. If your parents are strict, it's because they care for you. Not everyone has that. Life is too short. You should make it count. If you were given one year to live, would you squander the time you were given, or would you make every second count? Now act like that one year is 50 years, 60 years, 80 years, because before you know it, it will all come to an end. Don't count the seconds, count the memories, and live life to the fullest. Memento Mori, Lunis Honest. This concludes the Riverhawk Morning News. Have a great three-day weekend, and remember, be safe, be respectful, and wear your seatbelt.